This video will change the hosting history forever. Hello everyone, this is Foxy Everything Great tonight and today we are back for a brand new video on how to get a free up to 224 core or up to 2 terabytes of RAM VPS. Let's get started. Just before, don't forget to join my Discord down below. All the things you need to know about Earnify and then to serve economy bot that I'm working on and lots of other cool stuff. So let's get started. Okay, so for this, what we're gonna have to do is go to create an account. So we're gonna need to create a Gmail account. So there we go, we're gonna have to create a very new account. My name here, put all your information as normal and we're gonna put your uh, username. So for my account, uh, for my email, I'm gonna use uh, Cloudflare's free emails that you're gonna get after connecting to your account. There we go. When we are in, all we have to do is that we have to go to our um, domain names and after that, you can simply, and when you are here in your domain names, there we go, we're gonna choose this one. After that, we're gonna to go to emails as so. After, once we've done that, we're gonna to go to this link stay until the end because it's not what you think it is right and we are going to get free access so from here what we're going to have to do is that we're going to have to create an account that we will do right now with the email that we have just created of course gmails will work i'm just using mine because i am able to and there we go we're gonna put, i'm going to put french or france because that's my case you could whatever you need to verify your email when that's done, they're gonna send you an email. Me for my case, I'm gonna go on my phone. Okay, so you might get this message. As you can see, we have a got message. All you have to do is refresh the page. For this, after we're gonna ask you a business or institution name and what you, what kind of user you are. So I'm gonna put a, a media and graphics developer. Because why not? There we go. You always have to read everything until the end. I have a hundred percent read everything to make sure that everything is good and now you accept and you can choose to subscribe to some zone letters to get more information about uh, different types of services that Intel provides. You have successfully been applied for the Intel Developer Cloud Access. So let's get started. Once we're here, they can activate our accounts by provisionizing us up to three months of sandbox session. This will allow us to learn, prototype and experiment using Intel hardware. Of course, I am going to remind you all, my name is totally prohibited and you must not do that because it does not respect the terms of service. If this happens, we have to do is refresh the page and if you're gonna get a message saying you have already been registered like this, everything's good, and we're gonna go back to Intel Developer One API and get started. Once that's the case, they're gonna ask us uh, if we accept these terms that you must, of course, read before, very important, and submit. There we go. So, expiration date is in American, so it's the uh, November 3rd 2024 you can of course request an extension only at the end of your trial so you have all of this what's going to interest us today for this experiment will be um, the rendering kits because we'll be able to uh, no it's not going to be the rendering kits excuse me it's going to be the AI it's going to be the AI analysis Toolkit samples because we're going to use open SSH on Windows to make it much more easier. So what we're going to do is that we're going to copy this SSH key and so once that's done we're going to open our files. We're going to go here, go to users, put your name and dot SSH. You're going to open a second one here and you're going to drag this into there. I can do that. This was an old one for preparing my video also we're going to head back into the config file double click on that i'm going to open it with blog notes you might not have one so you're going to have to create one and you'll simply paste um, the code that is provided here um, after you can simply follow the steps to add it to your 
um, terminal and so now if I'm going to go to C, if I'm going to do Windows C and D and that I'm going to do Keith and self pressing the plus I'm going to tap on Dev Cloud I am going to be into a server so here we are that was quite quick wasn't it once that's done uh, we can already see uh, what kind of specs I have right now but as you can see it's only 10 calls and yeah 10 calls isn't really good if I'm gonna go see my RAM I only have 12 gigabytes and nah we don't really like that so let's make it better for that we're simply gonna have to go um, down below normally somewhere around uh, to get started and once we're gonna go pick down we're gonna see the clouds commands there we go what's going to interest us today is going to be job submission okay so once we're going to go down here you'll be able to see this command we're going to copy it right here and we're going to paste it boom boom of course you're going to have to delete the little uh, dollar sign i hate my life There we go. So these are all of the servers that are available right now. As you can see, 1024 gigabytes, uh, 256, 384. You can also have gold 6, 128. These are CPUs. Of course, there's lots. There's everything as you can see right here. And I'm gonna show you now how to connect to one of those. So I want to have this one you know because I'm a man that deserves it so what we're going to do is that we are going to go a bit up and as you can see we can request an interactive mode this interactive mode will let us execute commands into that server so let's copy that I'm going to paste it and instead of GPU because GPU if we're going to go a bit up we're going to see GPU is going to be um, given to 32 gigabytes and i9 or up, up to e2176g so these are xeons 64 gigabytes of RAM. this is not what we want right us like i said we want the 1024 so we're going to change this here and we're going to write um, dnp 50 there we go and now they're going to wait for a job and they're going to give me that job you know why? Because I asked for it and that's what's crazy because now I am currently able to have for 6 hours a 1024 gigabytes server with a Xeon. We're going to see right now which, uh, which CPU will be uh, borrowed for us. Um, while waiting this is able, this is enabling, I need to tell you that um, this is uh, not going to run 24 7 this is made for managing jobs training ai's and it's a great thing if you want to if you don't have the machine but you want to launch your own ai um, they have lots of documentation about it and it's just great so now that we now that we have done that if i'm going to do uh, i don't have the new fetch command i guess yeah of course so to fix that so there we go i have now my new fetch I'm just gonna copy this sorry for the little cut there I, I messed up my file so now that i found it i'm gonna be able to show you guys everything that we have got in this vps again just a reminder do not mind do not do any illegal activities on this these vps's are given especially for educational purposes such as learning how to use ai and involving it in everyday usage so Maybe now if I'm gonna check clone, there we go. Finally able to clone our get near fetch. I don't know why it wasn't not working before. Okay, so we're gonna CD into that. We're gonna make the installation. We are also going to make sure that this will become the main directory when making that command. And we're gonna launch the um, terminal. Now what I'm gonna do, let me go back to it. Let me clear that to make it a bit more fancy. There we go. This is what we have. A 2,224 uh, core, 512 gigabytes. Didn't I ask for 
one good night. So this scenario may happen. I asked for a one terabyte BPS bar only got a 512 gigabytes. That is annoying and let's fix it. So as here, no, it's okay, it, it just doesn't work. Okay, so let's just skip to the to the actual interesting parts. We're just gonna do two terabytes. Oh wait, no. How's it called? Run two terabytes. Sorry. So um, to get our RAM two terabytes, we're gonna just tap run two ter two TB for two terabytes. And this time we're gonna get an interactive session with two terabytes of RAM. So concerning the uh, one terabyte, I don't know why it gets only five hundred twelve device, though. I don't think any of you will need 512 and uh, 1 terabyte. And in case here, I'm going to show you how to get to. And uh, anyways, I think that's you. You can view everything. Uh, uh, maybe this one's going to give you 1 terabyte. Maybe GPUs. I, you have to check this out for yourself, right? So many different things. And here, as you can see, 2 terabytes of RAM. 160 cores of Intel Xeon Platinum. It's just crazy. All right, it's just crazy. So now that you have this, and I don't know, you want to. And now let's say you want to run a Python file, right? Uh, you cannot use pipe because it does not work, and the only Python file you only have is two point. 7.18 that's that's really old right but i have a solution a solution that will also let you install node.js with npm for that you're gonna have to join my discord down below because i will give you a file um, that will auto install python and node.js with conda so you'll be able to not only install those files but lots and lots of other packages from all the conda environments so you'll be able to install anything you would want that's inside that conda environment it's kind of the same as apt it's an apt alternative that doesn't need pseudo permissions and that you can execute on your vps i hope this video was very informative uh, please like and subscribe to my youtube channel because I'm trying to hit those 4,000 hours of watch time so I can finally make money out of these videos. Trust me, it's really frustrating to see all those views. There's ads on my future YouTube videos and I don't even get money out of it. It's crazy. So, please like and subscribe. It will really mean a lot. I hope you enjoyed this video. If yes, leave a comment down below to show your appreciation from the Discord. And just have fun with those EPSs, alright? Have a good time. So, here was Foxy. See you all. Mwah.